Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Brigitta, with an action haul, as I told in my AliExpress haul video. The first thing I'm going to show you is this, and it's not especially for Christmas, but I really liked the deco fabric that they had, the new ones. You get 70 by 100 centimeters, and I really love the colors of this. And this can be used all year, of course. I really like to make um, ruffle trims out of them. Maybe flowers or uh, bows, I'm not sure. Tie it around uh, the rings of a mini album or a journal. But yeah, I really loved the prints of this, so yeah. And I can also use it with Pink Christmas, of course. So that's this one. The next one is a die. There are a lot of dies at the Action from uh, Love to Craft and from other brands. Uh, I don't buy them all because it's just too much and, and sometimes it's a whole lot of the same thing. But this one I did not have. I do have a, a die for a mason jar. But this one is a shaker mason jar as you can see. It comes with the pieces to make it a shaker. And my other uh, mason jar only has this for the lid, the die. But I really like this effect so that it looks like there is... Um, fabric are uh, tied around the lid so yeah also comes with this to put it here so yeah i really like this the small tags are really cute so yeah i decided to take this home with me and then um i found these beautiful rhinestones i did see them on their website but they didn't have it at my action store for quite some time but now the last week they did have it so i decided to stuck up on them because I really use them a lot and they are always also nice to give out in, uh, in racks or swaps or something so yeah I think they are really beautiful really sparkly they are a little bit faceted can you see it it's just gorgeous and these can be used for Christmas of course yeah I just love them and I was really happy to find them uh, by now then for Christmas I bought a few of the of these bows. They also had the big ones, the jumbo jumbo ones, but I cannot find a use for them. But these ones I thought were really nice to use as packaging or something. I really love them. But what I did, I didn't um, I didn't bring a bag to the store with me because yeah, it came up to me to go to the action and I didn't have. A, when I was done working and I didn't have a bag with me. So I put this in my handbag. Well, I should not do that because my whole handbag is filled with glitter. I put six of them in them. And yeah, if I take something out of my handbag now, everything is uh, filled with glitter. So yeah, but I really like the bows. What I also really like are these. So I bought a few of uh, boat uh, styles. Gorgeous felt. Reindeers, so cute, love them. They are ornaments, but you can cut these off, of course, or use them like ornaments, what you want. I really love them to use in my crafting, so yeah. There are these ones. Then, two silver bottle brush. Don't know what I'm going to do with it, but now they still have them, and in a few weeks, everything will be gone. And what they also had were these cute cute gnomes i just love them and i could not resist them to put in my craft room they have a little bit of weight they stand like well they should stand like this but they don't i see so i have to lean them against something but i just love the gnomes so adorable so yeah i adopted two of them and now i'm going to show you the paper pads these are the christmas paper pads that they sell at Action. They are from Craft Sensations. And I went on a hunt for these because um, in the beginning of this week, I looked uh, every day in my store and they did not came in. I looked on the website, they were not on the website, but I had did see them on videos from uh, French and Belgian uh, girls. So I knew they would be in here soon. So I went uh, Tuesday, nothing was there. Then uh, I went yesterday and there were a few there, but almost nothing. So they came in yesterday morning and I came in yesterday evening after dinner and it was almost all cleared out. And then I decided, well, now I have to go to the other action store. And it was uh, half past eight in the evening. They close at eight o'clock and they are in the city near me, but it's a 10 minute drive 
around 10 minutes so i had to be quick and at 8 45 i needed to be in my gym for my zumba class so i didn't have a lot of time but i uh, i really really want to go because uh, in that action they mostly uh, run out of the craft items a little less fast than at my action store and yeah it was a guess maybe i was there for nothing but uh, I uh, got really lucky. They had all of the styles that came out and they had duplicates of them. So I brought a few home for my mom, a few home for my friends. So I was really happy that I did not uh, race against the clock uh, to there uh, and come home empty handed. So yeah, the first one is this. I will do a flip, quick flip through, but I just love them. Two of them I ordered double because or I took home double for myself because they are so gorgeous. This is one of them. It's a candy cane Christmas to you. I really like how they uh, give uh, names to the different paper blocks because now you know what you're talking about. So yeah, this is the first one. Love the color scheme of this with pinks, uh, maroon, green. Just love it. The uh, pages are single sided. They are, I believe... 230 gsm you get 24 designs 24 different designs i believe and they are single sided so this is a green diagonal striped one here is a cute one with dots and with small um, christmas trees this one i really love with the branches so adorable this one as well and some of the pages come with foiling so yeah pink red green just my favorite colors this one is cute as well it has cute gingerbread man and candy canes love this and because you get just one sheet of each i believe yeah i know for sure uh, that's also why i bought uh, of uh, some of the pads too because if i really like a page then i have an extra one to use all the blocks come with an advent calendar they look really cute, but I must be honest, I am not going to use this a whole lot. So for me, it doesn't have to be in the paper pad. They're still cute. You can still use them, but uh, I rather have uh, one of the cute patterns as a whole page. But yeah, you can get anything because these paper pads, these cost you two euro 45 cents. Do you hear it? It's almost not to believe. Two euros 45 cents are these paper pads from craft sensations really good quality and yeah they are really a bargain so that's why they are also so popular and go out so fast this look i have to pick it up because this is the most cute pattern you've ever seen look it has reindeers ballerinas christmas trees cup well just everything in a really small size with foiling pink green maroon yeah i just love this page i already have an idea what i'm going to make with this this is a beautiful page with uh, reeds modern style reeds love it as well it also comes with cutouts uh, my wish list is presents for and you can use it as journaling cards of course as tags as gift tags whatever you want this is a beautiful dusty pink with snowflakes on it this is a beautiful leaf one as well again red foiling these are cute winter hats and mittens here is a page with really glittery candy canes this one well i do not like as much these are cutouts but these are this presents for they are all gift tags but of course for crafters you can cut these off and then you can use them as journaling cards they are really cute so yeah i am for sure going to use them this is the page that we also had in dusty rose but then in a dark green or a mauve here is one without a design again the candy canes another one without a design here we have uh, how do you call this well the resp the menu menu cards for your christmas dinner to start main course dessert so really cute and i will for sure use this because we are going to entertain this christmas for our family we switch that around and this year's it's my turn or our turn cute page as well also a beautiful one here are a lot of 
cute reindeer. So this is the first paper pad, a candy cane Christmas for you. I still have one, two, three, four, five to go. So maybe you can get a cup of coffee uh, while you are uh, watching this. This one, I saw it on a video and I thought I would not like it. But when I saw it in real, yeah, I did take it home with me because it's so adorable and with the images that are on the inside, I think I can make really cute cards for my uh, nephew and uh, yeah, for my little nephews. That will be so cute for them. So the, it's called Have a Holly Jolly Christmas. And as you can see, there's nothing traditional about this. It has pinks, blues, greens, but such cute patterns. Let's take a look. This is the first one. And who? Who thinks about making a page with llamas, flamingos, unicorns and cassette tapes and leaves in one page? I don't know which crazy mind did make this up, but in the end it gave such a cute result. So yeah, I really like this. Then you have, yeah, this is a versatile one, purple with snowflakes. Here again, here we have socks with cats on the inside, different kind of cats. We'll lift it up, you can see it a little bit better. Look how cute. If you are a cat lover, this is so cute to uh, get a card in or use it. Beautiful blue. Again, an advent calendar page. Adorable. Here again. Again, the llamas, dinos, uh, cassette uh, or cassette players, but then in a blue scheme, different color scheme. Here we have pineapples with flamingos and plants, and yeah, really great. This one I like as well. Frame this, and you have a cute decoration for a children's room. Happy holidays! Here again, here we have uh, llamas, reindeers, and cactuses in presents. Uh, some of the menu cards and some of the journaling cards or yeah you can use this as a card front of course this one I like as well looks like a how do you call that an ugly sweater well I don't think they're ugly I love these patterns again here is a pig with antlers again a llama party hats here yeah. Really original prints, I must say. So original. Here we have the gift tags. Again, you can cut these off and use them as journaling cards. This one I really like as well. And it is like a bad, uh, an ugly sweater. But it also looked a little bit like an old game to me. How it is printed with the, the, the big pixels. Just like an old Pac-Man game style or something. Maybe I just see it in that and you think, what is she talking about? But yeah. That remind me of this. Here, a green chevron. This is also a nice print with silver foiling. Here it has a text, ho ho ho, dark blue with a little bit lighter blue. Here again, fa la la. Santa, oh what fun. Here, peace, ho ho ho, merry and bright. It's just a fun paper pad with happy, happy colors and papers. And really different, and as I said, really nice to use. Oh, this come with these tags as well. It's different from the other paper pads. But I think this is so nice to use when you have uh, little children or nephews or nieces that you uh, want to craft for for Christmas. So yeah, have a holly jolly Christmas. Then we go to, yeah, this is also one of my favorites. I just love traditional Christmas. This is called the best time of the year. And here we go. I have to get a sip of my drink. I'm getting a, a sore throat. It's really, uh, really warm today. In our holiday in the month of August, the weather was not so fine. But this week we get uh, really high temperatures. So yeah, it's really warm here in my craft room. Here a beautiful one. Love this. Gorgeous, gorgeous plaids. With gold striping in it. Love this. This I love as well. I'm going to say a lot of love. Because they're just beautiful. Gorgeous. This is a different one. Again a page. With the 24 or the 25. Numbers. Advent calendar. 
This one I like as well, poinsettias, candy canes, yeah. Another plaid. I think the plaids will never go out of style, just beautiful. Here we have a dark green with a gold polka dots, really fine polka dots in foiling. Again, some cut out cards. Here is a polka dot with white. This one will be beautiful as a scrapbook page with just a gorgeous photo and some extra decoration. This plaid I really love as well. This one also beautiful with black in the background. Here is a, um, a page with die cuts. Well, I say die cuts, but you have to fussy cut them out yourself. They do not pop out, but I really love the images. This one, gorgeous. I have a die that I can create this kind of car with. Love it, love it. Different plaid, really traditional one. I had a skirt when I was younger in this uh, this style of plaid. Loved it. Here, yeah, small Christmas trees. It's a print that we have seen in the first paper block again, or as well. So they do repeat some of the patterns, but in different color schemes spread over the paper blocks. Here is another one of the same prints, but then in green. Oh, I do think, no. Here a wish list, special delivery, gift list, the gift for you, with gorgeous gold foiling, green with polka dots. Oh, I have two of them, I love it. And again a print, ugly sweater print, and some cutouts, the same kind of tags, etc. as I, that you saw in the other paper block. So yeah, this was the, the most traditional one they had this year. And now we are coming to my favorite one, so you know them that I've ordered two of these and it's it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. And already the cover is so cute with the reindeer and the gold foiling. Love it. Let's start. Again a plaid, but there's nothing traditional about this. With pinks and black and white. Love this. Here we have reindeers with gold leaves. And black and white candy canes. This one is cute as well with mason jars filled with stuff. Yeah, it's a small prints, really hard to see. So yeah, that's this one. Again, the cut apart sheets. So this presents for they all say I'm not going to use them for this. I will cut this off. Black and white stripe. Here we have. Uh, Christmas trees in white and black on the pink background. Just gorgeous black and white snowflakes. This one is so adorable as well with different styles of Santas. This one has cute glasses. Do you see it? Oh, I, how I love this. This one I really like as well. Just a pink with white stripe. Again, the advent calendar. Really love the, the reindeer cup. So adorable. Beautiful ornaments on a white background. Here is some foliage again, but then on black. Cute presents with silver foiling. Here we have snowflakes in silver foiling on a striped background. Cut apart again, the tags, small cut aparts, all with foiling, with silver foiling. Here are cute cocoa cups, we really love this page as well. Pink one, beautiful background page. What to use in the journal, you can write on that print easy, of course. Here they are, uh, yeah, look, those are uh, Christmas trees with legs and they are hugging each other. Again, the menus. Here we have the white foliage on pink, cute polka dots, candy canes with Christmas trees on black. Yeah, just a modern style Christmas paper pads. And this is beautiful as well with gold. So yeah, this was my favorite one. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. So yeah, then we go to the 
the next one the fourth one this one is called have yourself a merry little christmas you can already see it with greens and browns a little bit more natural a little bit more vintage romantic style this one is beautiful foliage on green this one i really like as well with the old ice skates and with the old candy canes look the candy cane that i have a die for now from ellie that i can recreate these are it's hard to see but these are christmas trees in gold and white really hard to see it's a little bit uh, too uh, full this one love this again an advent calendar page base with white polka dots beautiful vintage page as well with an old clock roses yeah beautiful here we have some gold christmas trees on brown here we have some foliage again with orange slices and pine cones here is the caterpillar seeds merry christmas and a happy new year gift tracker so yeah you can use this of course in your journals as well or in your uh, bullet journals beautiful background page yeah these are uh, really versatile you can use them on any projects not only for christmas reindeers another one of this one here we also have the images that you can cut out beautiful again really like this so rustic it's a rustic christmas yeah that's the right word to say this one is beautiful as well so cute and in brown look like a wall here we have the christmas trees again but on a different background some gift labels naughty or nice they already crossed the nice so yeah with this paper pad you cannot be naughty and again the page with the labels and the circles and yeah and again you have to fussy cut them out yourself nothing is perforated and now we go to the last one and that's also a little bit of a rustic rustic traditional one and that santa claus is coming to town this one i really like this one it's also traditional with gold and yeah it looks a little bit like uh, a quilt i think like it's quilted together this is cute as well with yeah what's really uh, how do you call that yeah really cute houses whimsical with whimsical houses this page this is the caterpillar the caterpillar page but it yeah it, it has photos on it can you see it they're all just photo images yeah this one beautiful light reflections here is the piece with the caterpillars yeah Kijk, something like this or this you will know Brigitta is not cutting that out too tiny or too yeah too much work this one is the the how do you call that the wood slices with engravings in it looks like so yeah the wood pattern always cute here we have the orange slices again but then in a big pattern with pine cones here is the advent calendar i really like this one with just the greenery uh, as decoration as images a photo page here we have beautiful ornaments this one something to read something i need so planner related cutouts Mmm, looks yummy, 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 yummy. This one. This one with gold foiling. Love this. Also really beautiful. The photo page again. Here we have the menu cards. That's new. They didn't do that before and now they put it in almost every paper block. This one is cute as well. It comes with a record player, an old-fashioned one. 
I still have a box of old records in my attic, but we don't have a player anymore, so. But one of my uh, daughter's girlfriends has uh, an old record player, and she really likes to buy and play an old record from, uh, fr from uh, artists from um, when we were younger. So yeah, but she is uh, just uh, 19, so she really likes old music, she has an old soul. And I think maybe we should uh, give her the box with the old records so that she can uh, use them uh, sometime. I think she will like that. And they are just getting dusty in our attic, so because we don't use them. This is a beautiful one as well, look. They are uh, hanging elements with doves on the inside and tassels. Yeah, beautiful prints. This one as well. Again, a wood grain. And that was the last page. I hope you are still here. I know it was a lot, but I really wanted to show them to you because I do think they are outdone themselves this year at Craft Sensations. The papers are just beautiful, really versatile. A lot of different blocks. So for everyone's taste, you can find something. So yeah, this was all I wanted to show to you that I bought at the action. I hope you liked it. If you do, please give me a big thumbs up. You can subscribe to my channel if you've not already done that. And I hope you will be back for my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.